In this view, we will be demonstrating the submental vertex view of the skull, known as the full basal. The submental vertex view of the skull should be performed with the patient standing or sitting at the upright bucky or lying supine on the radiographic table with a 40 inch source to image distance and no tube angulation. The submental vertex, I have my patient standing at the upright bucky. The mid sagittal plane is running uh, perpendicular. We're gonna hyperextend his neck, placing the vertex of his head on the board. This will form the IOML, the infraorbital meatal line, parallel to the IR. The central ray enters directly through the cella tersica, perpendicular to the IOML. The mid sagittal plane through the throat passes through a three quarters of an inch anterior to the EAM, which is the external auditory meatus. A diagnostic submental vertex view of the skull, also known as the full basal, radiograph must be free of motion and rotation. Demonstrated anatomy to include symmetrical mandibular condyles, foramen magnum centered, and proper visualization of soft tissue and bony detail. If you enjoyed this video, I encourage you to visit CloverLearning.com and explore our robust selection of video-based courses, certification exam prep question banks, and continuing education resources. Lastly, please remember to hit the like button, subscribe, and turn on notifications so you can stay up to date on our latest videos.